what up everybody welcome back to our channel today's video is going to be a highly requested video of how i prepare and buy groceries for, for a family of nine ten ten today we are going to bring you along with us of what i do how i do it and where we go and all that good stuff please stop molesting me as i'm holding the camera Shut up. so if you want to watch how I prepare and cook and shop and all that good stuff, follow us. Follow, follow, follow. So first things first, what I do is I make a list of the dinners that I'm going to have through the week. So Monday through Monday is what I do because Monday again I go shopping. So I don't want to go shopping and have to cook dinner on that day. So I have dinner already prepared. So I go through a list of my dinners of what I'm going to cook for the week and then I make another list of what I need to complete those dinners for the week kind of just being organized so then that way when you go into the store you know what you need you know what you need to get and you're not over buying or under buying you also have time to look for either coupons or deals or anything like that if you're actually searching around for those things you know what you're looking for right now i just went ahead and went over my list um just so you guys can have a little idea monday we're gonna do spaghetti and sauce with bread um garlic bread then tuesday we're gonna do sausage bell peppers and rice wednesday we do pork chops potatoes and vegetables um thursday is barbecue chicken and a veggie and salad friday i do alfredo noodles and uh bread Saturday is chicken soup, so we just put chicken legs, carrots, squash, potatoes inside the chicken soup. Sunday is going to be bean burritos, so I just get beans, sauce, onions, cheese, all the stuff to put in bean burritos. And then Monday, we're going to do meatballs, so I'm going to do meatballs, salad, and garlic bread again. And then Monday, I'll make another list, go shopping for the next week, and therefore, therefore. And then I switch up the dinners every week. I don't do the same repeated dinners constantly, so we do do different things. I did put on my list other things that I need to get through the lunches. So I do put corn dogs, soups, um, hot pockets, bologna, eggs, milk, cereal, all the little things that I need to get us through the week as well for breakfast. And if any of you want to know, this is my outfit of the day it is a cute little like poncho thing with some boots and yeah this is how i'm going all right you guys so we are currently in the car it is 2 14 right now and we're waiting for melania to get out of school we came to pick her up before we went grocery shopping because you guys know how that is you start doing something and then you're running late and then you're rushing and it's just a hot mess so we're picking our kids up from school first and then well we're picking melania up from school my dad's picking up the boys and then we're gonna go to the store and then complete our grocery shopping people that don't know our kids go to different schools. Yes, this is true. So my boys go to one school, Melania goes to a different school. The reasoning for this is because I used to work a corporate job and my daughter went to a daycare that um, she's been going to since they were born. And the school is closer to daycare, so it was just so much easier to have her in the school closest to the daycare. And my dad picks up my boys because they're older, so it's not an issue. So they go to the school right next to my house. So my dad picks up the boys, and we have to go pick up Melania, which is not a big deal. It's really not. But thanks for the FYI, hubby. Of the day. FYI of the day. All right, you guys, we just pulled up to the store. We're about to go in. I got my list. I got my children, oh, we're about to get it. Okay, and this is gonna be interesting. Your face, why is it so dirty? Because I eat ketchup. Well, clearly, clean your face. Well, it's all dirty. No, your face is clean. Um, all right, you guys. First things first, the first meal of the day. I'm just gonna go through the line. What, what was she saying when she was here? 89 cents for wheat. Yeah. And then 129 for white bread. So we're gonna get one wheat and one white. 
$2.49 for a bag of onions. 99 cents for the zucchini squashes. I'm going to get about three of these for the soups. Okay. Thank you. We're gonna have one more. My big helper. Okay, and one more. And I dropped them all. All right. Okay, tie it up in a bag. It's hard. Tie it in a, tie it in a knot. She said, she, are you cold? Yes. <laughs> a little bit. We also need a bag of carrots. I'm going to take two bags. Because I don't think one's going to be enough. There you go. Go put these in the cart. No, don't put those in the bag. Because these are already bags, baby. Okay, we'll use this for um, something else. We also need a bag of potatoes. $2.99. Can you get it? Oh, big girl. Put it at the bottom. Oh, not on the bread. Uh, those aren't ours. That's not mine, baby. Put it back. That's not ours, baby. Okay, give her a bag. So she'll have a bag. Three? Um, yeah, do three of those. Amina, do three of the green, okay? And you're gonna do three of the red? Yes. One, two, three. Good job. No more. No more. That was it. Go give that one to daddy. Tell him to tie it in a knot. I feel like I'm fine. You're going to tie it in a knot? All right. So we got everything down for the vegetables. Now we're going to go to the meat. Hello. How did I get stuck with the kids and he just leaves us like nothing? Always finding friends. All right, so we found, no, we don't need that. So we need the stove top and dressing for meatballs. Um, you want two of the turkey? All right, so we need two of these. It is so hot today and everybody is staring at me record. I don't think they like it very much, but yeah. All right, so barbecue sauce. Now I need to find a barbecue sauce that is cheap, so, Look at this one. 10 for 10. $1.99. $3.49. You just have friends everywhere, don't you? $1.49. No, I don't want that one. Um, $1.49 is the lowest that I see here. So I'm gonna get two of these. Here you go. But I need spaghetti. Right there, baby. Uh, 119 for the bow noodles. Grab the bows down there at the bottom. Nope, down, 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 down. Grab that one right there. Yeah, how much is that? Oh, 119 for a bag of spaghetti. Give me. Yeah, this is good for us. We need marinara sauce. And I need two of them. And I, I get the big gallons. One of these big ones. But I don't like ragu. I like the prego sauce. Melania. Um, no, I don't want my, Get the traditional in the back. Back, 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 back there. Get two of them. They don't have my Alfredo sauce. Uh oh. What? You know, the one thing that I will not compromise on is Alfredo sauce. Because they all taste different. Alright, so for our bean burritos, I grab traditional and spicy jalapeno. Grab that one right there. And yes, 159 and 159. I grabbed two cans. And now we gotta keep looking to the next aisle. All right, you all ask me what sausage I get. This is the sausage that I get, the turkey smoked sausage. Um, I get two of these to feed my family. Um, I picked up the leg meat. And then I also picked up the pork chops. 
and I picked up a leg, boneless, skinless leg meat as well. And I don't know where my, oh there it is, Give me. I didn't know where my thing went, so. I know it is freezing in here. All right, so we're here at Food for Less, and when you're at Food for Less, you have to bag your own bag, which I guess is why everything's cheaper. But my receipt, hold on, baby. I paid a total of uh, $132.53. All right, you guys, so we just left Food for Less. We got most of the stuff that was on my list. There was some things that they didn't have or were too expensive here. So we're going to go to another store and get the remaining stuff. But there was some stuff my husband put in to this pile of groceries that was not on my list. So, including my dad's 30 pack of beer. But we ended up spending $132 and my dad's, my dad's Budweiser was what, $21, $21. So, given the fact that I spent over a little bit, a little bit over a hundred bucks and my limit was 200 is good. We're going to go again to one more store, so we'll be back. All right, you guys, sorry my lighting is horrible. Oh, look, this is good lighting. Um, so, what, son? Can we not do this on camera? <laughs> yes, hold on, let me finish this. So, I just got home from shopping. I put all the groceries away, I started dinner, as you guys can see, sausage and bell peppers. And then I am making rice. So we're gonna go ahead and put the sausage and bell peppers on the rice. Um, and as soon as that's done, so I look a little crazy on camera right here. There I feel like a lot of people overcook with they don't need so they want to do these extravagant meals when you have a family when you have a family of 10 hot dogs and french fries is like a wonderful dinner hot pockets, hot pockets. Hot pockets. i'm telling you my kids are not we're not fancy we don't do crazy things I do spaghetti nights i do pizza nights sometimes i don't even buy dinner for a specific night and we get five dollar little caesar pizzas and my kids love it, which is way cheaper than going and buying pizza or making pizza. Ah, best advice to anybody that has a big family or just wants to learn how to budget their meals, organize, meal prep, and write it down and do your research. Uh, again, all about trial and error. Whatever works for you, works for you. What works for us, works for us. But that is my insight on it. I hope you guys enjoyed. This video wasn't very long. We didn't really do too much stuff. Um, my lipstick's all messed up from from drinking frat paste and stuff. But anyways, I hope you all enjoyed. Thank you. Make sure to subscribe, like, share, all that good stuff. I don't even remember everything that they tell you to do, but do it. And I love you. And please comment below what you would like my next video to be. And follow me on Instagram. Love you. Bye.